My mother started working on the tea plantations when she was 17 years old. She would get up early in the morning when the mist was still down and climb the mountains barefoot with a basket over her head and she would have to pick 16 to 20 kilos of tea for a day to earn about four dollars and it was a hard day's work and this is how they spent their lives. She never had the opportunity to go to school None of the members in my family generations before had the opportunity to go to school. They were Indian Tamils brought down by the British from India to work on the plantations. So that's how the generations have been going on for. And I was born on a mud floor uh, with a tin roof, mud walls. We didn't have running water, we didn't have electricity. Our family had to use a common tap or we had to collect water two kilometers away. They would have to carry the water on their heads in a big pot and that's how they would get their water. Uh, we, had to have, uh, we had to share a public common toilet and we didn't have any toilet facilities. And This is the conditions that I was born in. But I believe and my mom always says God's grace and God's faithfulness and God's actually plan in our lives has brought us this far. My name is Rebecca Alexander and I'm the Chief Operations Officer at Wings of Hope Lanka, which is partnering with International Needs Australia. <music>